Hello everybody, my name is Tex and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be comparing the Heritage Shotgun, which is the new Deepstone Crypt Slug Kinetic Shotgun, with the first in last out from Season of Arrivals. And essentially the reason we want to do this test is that Heritage has access to two new perks, which are Reconstruction and Recombination, which you can roll at the same time. And recombination basically makes it so that elemental kills give you a stacking buff up to 10 times and increases the damage of the next shot. But it's only the first shot. So we're going to test here, and uh, with reconstruction, we see it does an insane amount more damage. Um, which, uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of crazy. But then we test first and last out just to be sure because it can get Vorpal, which Heritage does not. And so uh, with that first shot, we're going to end up doing a lot more damage, and if we want to be able to see actually how, mu how many shots first and last dot has to fire off to overcome that damage, it's going to be about uh, 10 shots. And so any damage phase shorter than 10 shots, Heritage is going to be hands down better. But for any damage phase longer, um, like Tanix, we're going to go over that here, which is uh, now we're going to be taking into account the other perk from Heritage, which is... Uh, reconstruction and so basically it's auto loading holster but it will slowly double your mag size over time so it will be up at 12 shots with assault mag and so uh, I had to kind of Frankenstein the stuff together there because my uh, reconstruction heritage does not have assault mag but I have a different one that does so I Frankenstein together it should be correct and then uh, we compare that to auto load on um, first and last out for 2 mag DPS, and then uh, we also compare that to just loading one slug and firing it for 2 mag on uh, first and last out. And uh, we end up with these DPS values here. Um, Heritage is definitely a little bit better than the competition. Uh, manual load first and last out means you can't reapply anarchy or anything like that. Um, which also I guess you wouldn't be doing with Heritage, but overall I do think that uh, Heritage is going to be better than first and last out and uh, There is one little uh, a little bit of a meme we can test out here um, Involving both shotguns and so if you use Aphidian Aspects on Warlock you can fire off uh, 12 shots by hot swapping between the two shotguns really fast um, And it actually lets you fire it faster than the normal fire rate and we get 8.3 seconds, and so taking into account, we would have the extra damage from the first shot of Heritage, and then six Vorpal shots from first and last out, and then five normal shots. And so, uh, yeah, it's going to do the best DPS, but it's not really that reliable. Um, but my overall thoughts and opinions is that Heritage is the better shotgun if you can get Reconstruction and Recombination. Um, overall, it's going to do more damage uh, because it's uh, both a kinetic and also your most damage phases aren't. You're gonna, not going to be doing uh, 10 shots at once. Um, and also, it's better DPS for short damage phases. So, overall, I think Heritage is better. Um, that's it for me for today. I hope this was informative. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao.